नमस्कार एंड अ वेरी गुड मॉर्निंग वेलकम टू द वेब कास्ट फ्रॉम कोडक सिक्योरिटीज आई एम योर होस्ट एंड गाइड एंड इंडिया बैनर्जी द मिनट्स ऑफ द लास्ट फेडरल रिजर्व मीटिंग केम आउट येस्टडे एंड इट वॉज क्लियर दैट द फेड मेम्बर्स वर सेंग दैट द करंट स्पाइक इन इन्फ्लेशन विच मे सस्टेन फॉर द नेक्स्ट फ्यू मंथ्स इज टेम्पररी एंड दे आर नॉट गोइंग टू बी हाइकिंग रेज जस्ट बिकॉज द इन्फ्लेशन हैज गॉन अप बिकॉज दे एक्सपेक्ट दिस इन्फ्लेशन टू कम डाउन एज द ईयर प्रोग्रेसिस however the most important point which many of the members said is if the current pace of economic recovery continues in america then at some point in time the federal reserve will be forced to uh, become hawkish that is to reduce the purchases of assets and to even consider hiking rates so this is being termed as a hawkish tilt of the fed and as a result of which we are seeing the equity sell off and dollar rise overnight us stock markets fell close to half a percent and asian equity markets are down anywhere between half a percent to 1 percent dollar index is rising and even the asian currencies are uh, seeing some uh, weakness against the us dollar a combination of all these things means that uh, dollar rupee in may futures may open flat to marginal higher around 73 Uh, 25 to 73 28 levels now after this uh, relentless decline from 75 half to all the way down to 73 yesterday it looks like the dollar rupee uh, downtrend may have run its course because uh, going by historical uh, down, uh, down moves from the highs it seems like 2 and a half rupees move more or less uh, indicates that we have may may have reached the uh, the end of this down leg so a sort of a upward pullback may be in store now we have to keep in mind the very important uh, support at 73 so as long as 73 is not being ta- uh, taken out this support is not being taken out then this possibility exists that uh, dollar rupee may try to push towards 7355 and 7360 levels which is a formidable resistance zone intraday basis 7336 remains an interim resistance and then it is 7355 to 7360 and support is between 73 and 7310 so what you can do how to play this one is if it gets closer to 7310 uh, or below that then you can attempt a long because your stop uh, stop loss is small it will be uh, let's say below 7295 if it begins to trade below 7295 you exit your longs or else you continue to hold expecting a rise towards 7355 to 7360 now cl- uh, closer to 7360 it is uh, it will again f- face major supply and and resistance so the n- near term range is going to be possibly between 73 to 7360 on the may futures on the gbp inr and euro inr we expect a more or less uh, choppy uh, range bound price action and on the yen we continue uh, further downside uh, 6690 to 6680 is what we are lo- uh, looking at as levels on the yen inr may futures uh, today as uh, there are no major economic data uh, so the currency market will take cues from the broader risk sentiments and what's happening in the equity markets so that's it folks have a fantastic day